Hello everyone, and welcome back to Stellaris and our cooperative Let's Play as giant intergalactic rat bastard scumbags that we like to call Bromance Brute Force. I am Scumbag Mal, and I'm joined by fellow scumbags Vanguard and Sabouts. Greetings, greetings and salutations to you scumbags. Hello. Arr. Greetings, fellow <laughs> Did you become a pirate? You're, you're a pirate a scumbag now? I'm a pirate I'm a spider pirate scumbag. Okay, somebody, somebody's gonna meme that. Somebody's gonna get a pirate hat and stick it on, like, a spider <laughs> picture now. You watch. Yeah. Some, somebody already sent me a... There's a movie called Big Ass Spider, and somebody already sent me a... A clip from that movie saying this is basically you when you invade a planet and it was a giant spider like attacking people at a park it was hilarious <laughs> that's awesome oh, it was so funny awesome. it was like and it's one of those you know like sharknado like the kind of like those like really low budget movies <laughs> it was like the same thing so it was like it was like super like <laughs> poor quality but it was really funny that's nice <laughs> awesome so mel yes Oh, I hear we were there's gonna... some people who want to die. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. That's right. We do. We do. Hey, have, have you guys? Just real quick, p pull up your faction screen. Have you guys messed around with the factions at all yet? I've looked at it. Yes, I briefly looked Ooh. at it. I haven't messed with it. Not gonna touch that stuff. That looks crazy. I mean, like I have this new faction that just popped up with a five size and. They're all kinds of pissy. Like, everybody that's part of that faction is mad. And I'm like, okay. So... Do you do you suppress them? Um, and then they become... They, they, they th changed the system a lot, Mal. It's not like it used to be. I see that too. I have no idea what you do. Like, embrace or suppress? Uh, I don't if know, you like... embrace, it's going to change the... Yeah. ...base government of your empire. Just be careful with that. Okay, so I'm And if you suppress, it's like faction happiness drops, um, monthly influence drops. It's, it's I yeah. mean, I, I guess if as long as the faction's not too big, you just leave it alone. But just in general, I've had more challenges with happiness than I've had in previous playthroughs. And I think also, too, for me, I, as I was telling you guys before we started recording, the whole I've got the primary race that you know, is supposed to be like, whatever, like overlord guys. And then I have that subservient race that's, you know, Incoming only supposed to do certain tasks, right? Because I only get bonuses in that case. Yeah. So one of the things I did in between episodes, I just want to show people is that I did move around a lot of this, the, the dis or dice, the secondary species. I did move them around and balance things out some, so. I've tried I to send you I've tried to fix both that. gifts, by the way. Sorry. Yeah. I just wanted to make sure you guys grabbed them up. Complete. Let's see. Okay. Pretty yeah. important strategic research for both of you. I think it's going to help. Yeah, it is. Thank you. What did you send me? I sent you a gift. Oh, living metal is very strong. 5% armor and who regeneration monthly. That's yeah. very strong. Yeah. Oh, aren't you that's, a aren't you a sweet spider? That's gonna help. <laughs> well, I would never send that to like a peaceful empire. I only sent it to you guys because you're d bags <laughs> like yeah. me. Come bags unite. So torpedoes <laughs> are really strong, obviously, against capital ships and worthless against any small craft, right? Yeah. Yes. Uh, yeah. Everything smaller than a battleship, torpedoes are pretty much useless. I'm not gonna worry about that right now. Then. Okay. So is the plan? that we're going to and i'll go ahead and put us up to fast speed now that we're kind of squared away um is the plan then that we're going to go up and take on the myth fell confederacy yeah let's go up there. Um, yeah i'm gonna send ships up there now actually we're gonna want to take them on before they start getting allies so my fleet's already in route okay that's i good. need to repair and refit and i also need to train boy that's quite the journey I need to train some uh, armies. Actually, yeah, you're gonna take you're gonna take all those planets. I'm not gonna take any of them. So, this is funny. The slave army of my like guy like my subservient guys are stronger than my regular army guys. So I'm gonna build them instead. Research complete. Going to war, okay, boys. So Going to war. Point. 
War. Ooh, capacitor shields, very cool. Okay, so it's about that 5k fleet is your main fleet, is that correct? Either I have a 5k fleet, yes. Okay, so Mal, yours is the 3.2k, correct? Yeah. Okay. Unless this upgrade I'm about to do does something special. Yeah, I have a 3.3 fleet. Nice. Okay, so we're this all pretty sure. good. We're all pretty yeah. uh, well balanced right now. Figure out the position of my fleet. Ooh, upgrades, are get, upgrades are getting pricier. Yep, yeah. they are. Just upgraded it will the only fleet get again. worse. And it, yeah, got a little bit pricier. Hey, I'm showing my ship designs just so people can see what we are doing. If you guys want to do the same. You know what? That's a good idea. Yep. Yeah. So... so they understand what we are trying to do. Okay, guys. So if you miss anything, just pause the video. I've got a vet with small disruptors and extra energy for rate of fire. And then I've got a dis I've got a destroyer with medium fusion, small fusion missiles, small disruptors, and then set up the same way. I did get hyperdrive type two engine too, which was kind of nice. And improved awesome. medium deflectors. Do you guys have medium deflectors yet, or are you on the shields already? Um, I, mm -hmm. I have I'm using Research complete. Armor right now. Yeah. Bill, I have medium deflectors, yes, but only one. And I'm I'm using a mix of both because I don't have enough power yet. I don't have any reactors that they can push up enough power. Up. Oh, I see. Good call. What I found works best is using deflectors on ships that have very huge dodge chance. If your ship has low evasion, armor works better for them. Most in the case, most cases. Unless you're fighting specific type of, types of weapon, I mean, if you're fighting against few damaging weapons, just go full armor. If you're fighting against armor weapons, just go full shields. Did they make That's building? Did they make building of armies faster? I don't know why it seems faster. Mm. I guess it's not. It just seems like it is. Yeah. Maybe it's because of her empire have some something. I don't know. My fully is still in route. Copy that. Okay, so the Kutarian Empire asked me to be their, I don't know, not friends. I forgot the name of this in English. Sorry, guys. Defensive Pact Invitation. Should I accept it or not? Well, we can always break it later uh, if we have to. Yeah, okay. I guess I say go ahead and accept it. They're pretty... Uh, cool guys and they help yeah. save they're pretty me, cool so. guys i wonder why <laughs> you're saying that. i'm just saying i think they're i wonder neat guys. i wonder why you're saying they're that the cute. starfish are cool <laughs> i don't they're know cute. Reason. no reason i mean look at them how could you say no oh i know right they are kind of like adorable <laughs> just unlocked my second ascension perk so um, Research complete. I just got cheaper war demands too. That was nice. That was a nice pickup right there. <laughs> nice. <laughs> you <laughs> bastards are gonna die. Oh, I got a little bit, got a little bit uh, into that. <laughs> you kind of scared me a little bit, but I was gonna let you. I was gonna let you have it. Thanks, I appreciate it. <laughs> got a little worked up. I got a little worked up. What can I say? Okay. Oh. Research complete. Oh. I don't even. You know, it's been a while since we've done ground combat or whatever. Uh, that I'm like trying to remember, like how much do we really need? And I guess we're gonna find out. I, I built a bunch. Something like I don't know against insane AI if they build armies at all. But if they do, if they do not, then is way, way much. <laughs> that makes sense. Hope so. <laughs> I heard you. I understood you, sir. I understood. Okay, sorry. I understood. <laughs> Man, I'm keeping my uh, my construction ships busy. Holy moly! Picked up a bunch of resources with those um, outposts. 
Yeah. So my, I've got two constructor ships just building stuff nonstop. It's like, good, good job, boys. You keep going. Yeah, my <laughs> I had uh, I went down to one construction ship. I always go down to one after like I built everything and I just leave it on standby. And my economy yeah. now that call. now that I have my primary race doing all the energy stuff. And I've got things kind of balanced out a little bit. Got some energy improvement. I'm finally not super broke. Nice. Nice. Yeah, yeah like I'm only down That's negative awesome. one, which doesn't sound good, but I have a bunch of upgrades about to go through, and I'm actually going to go into positive energy. So I'm, I'm really excited about that, about not being broke. Oh, what the heck? These guys just insulted me. I'm going to insult them back. The first thing I always do when somebody insults me is I insult them right back. <laughs> I'm not going to stand for that. Ships My Admiral just... I'm sorry for him. Oh, that was hanged. Okay. That reminds me, do I have an Admiral on my fleet? I do, right? Yes. And he's actually a pretty decent Admiral. I just hope... I just hope that my Admiral... He's 75. I'm just hoping he doesn't die before we can do this war, because he's oh, four, God. He's he's four star. Oh, God, yeah, he's four star and he's got like improved combat speed. He's got plus 10 to weapons range. Like he's really, really good. My Admiral's 73, so I'm right there with you. I'm going to start going for techs that increase leader age. Oh, these guys just grabbed another. Yeah. Oh, I guess they already had that. I was going to say they grabbed. Oh, another... what the heck? It's declared war on our <laughs> ally. Yeah, <laughs> I saw this coming. <laughs> We are now at war with with who? Okay, we're going to war. He, Everybody, kid, I'm alone. What, who are these guys? I don't know. I had oh, my the guys fleet down all... there at the bottom. Yeah, I had my fleet all the way down there too. That's the funny part, or not funny, oh, depending on how you wanna. Oh, these... I can help you with these guys. No, I'm still depending on how you guys want to look at it. But either way, the Katarian Empire are part of this war as well. Well, let them handle it then. Let's go punch these other guys' ticket. Here we go. Oh, they, I gotta go down. They're not gonna, they won't be able to handle it all because I boarded these guys. They're actually gonna go for me. And the Katarians aren't gonna come down and all help right. me. Well, do you want me to come with you or do you want me to go do this? Uh, guys, um, guys, they yes. have uh, 11k fleet on, on my station. <laughs> nice. Wow, guys. that's a large fleet. Okay, do you guys are seeing this? And just pause the game so you can see. Just look at my top, my top left system Kirian. that's where their fleet is is located um so, it's larger than 11k it's 20k wait, over wait, 20k wait 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 wait, wait, wait. yeah where are we there actually there are two fleets kiran plime kiran plime wow, nobody says dead. that name. Who, who's, <laughs> yeah whose fleet is, is this is the guys that just declared no 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 it's their yeah. allies yes <laughs> the tom tom bater wait a minute are you saying that the oh uh oh so you're saying that this uh -oh. primarily and whatever prime guys and the green dudes their allies. are their allies yeah if you click on the click on the war score dot chart at the bottom yeah they have two fleets of one 10k one 12k so yeah they just declared war on all of us so we need to uh you're also in the war mail if you didn't know Oh yeah, no, yeah. I know I'm in, but oh, okay. um, yeah, so <laughs> I'm not I'm not happy about it. I'm not happy about it. No, this is not good at all. Especially because my fleet is halfway across the world. <laughs> okay, well, um so what do you guys want to do? <laughs> I'll fight them. <laughs> There's nothing else we can do. <laughs> okay, so um I'm I just would going move your, to I would hide your fleet fleets. for now. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to do. I'm gonna go bankrupt over building Corvettes, but I've got nothing else to do. Um, I have to build a fleet that's going to be large enough to take these guys on. I don't know how. Yeah. Oh, this so, is... Let me see the ship composition they are using, because this might help us. But there a choke? Are there some choke points anywhere? I'm like looking... Yeah, Actually, using... what's nice is that I'm kind of hiding behind wow. the Katarian Empire. Guys, just click on the fleet and see what kind of weapons they're using. <laughs> they're using Gauss cannons tier five. Oh, yeah that's going to hurt a lot tier five yes tier five large and medium on their cruisers the destroyers same thing boy yeah so and they're using a mix of shields and armor so 
Yes. So, so we have we using have equivalent armor at torpedoes. We have equivalent deflector tech. They've got better armor. They're one up on energy, and they're two to three tiers up on weapons. Yeah. So basically, <sighs> how we defeat them is just beauty. go for their allies. Yeah. Go for armor. Ignore shields. Shields won't help you because they're using Gauss weapons and avoid larger ships because their corvettes are using torpedoes so just build i don't know armored destroyers maybe yeah those, are, they, armored those should be the best ones yeah armored uh, yeah. destroyers or armored corvettes both of them should work i'm sending my fleet down now i'm gonna go straight for their ally if i could take on you know one or two of their allies planets i can probably well, call call a turn call a call a rendezvous Call a rendezvous system and let's meet wherever that system is. And then, and then call Etra, a target. Or actually, Eglor. Eglor. Okay, I'll look for that it's, in a second. Okay, yeah. So, guys, Ed, actually, the correct build is just Corvettes and put armor on them. Make them as fast as you can with armor. Okay. That, that's how you defeat the enemy fleet. All right. So, unfortunately, I only have nano composite armor, which kind of sucks, but. Uh, that's. I'll make it yeah, work. Yeah, shields, they just going to ignore your shields or chew through them very fast because they're using Gauss weapons, so... Now I wish I had gotten Afterburner tech. I had I had it, too, and I passed on it. I was like, oh, I don't need that right now. I wish I had taken it. Okay, so delete that. Yeah, and I'll just start overbuilding on Corvettes, too. Lucky the, the Katarian Empire is also a part of this. And they're pretty powerful, so they're yeah, not, they're not 20k powerful. Yeah, I was gonna say they're not 20k powerful. But they do have like 10k. So combined with our three, we do have enough. Yep. All right. So I guess this is the best I can do. Okay, so I'm gonna conduct the retrofit, and then where did you want to meet Eglor? I see where it is, right on the border. Yep, right All on right. the border of their territory. Alright, recalling my ships now. Well, my fleet's all the way across the galaxy right now because I was getting ready to go to war with those guys. So is mine. And they're actually hitting my system right now. They have a 10k fleet. They're coming for something. I don't know what. And they right just now. jumped the 12k oh. fleet on top of me. I this didn't even have time to, to evade them, so. Oh, did they right on top of your fleet? Yeah, I just took out 3k of their fleet with mine, so that's the best I can do. <laughs> <laughs> System survey this is getting bad real quick. Yeah. <laughs> We it might, is. you might want to. It might be the best bet to negotiate for peace, and agree agree to give up like a planet or something, and humiliation or something like that. Yeah, if they give me the option, no, I would no, let, they want to vassalize by. him. Yeah, that was the terms. I didn't even see yeah. that. So who? Wait. So yeah. who was the primary? Who was the primary target? You? Yes, it's me. You were the they primary were... target, and we got pulled in because yeah. you were our buddy. No, oh. no, no. They declared war on uh, Sabouts. Okay. You and me that Complete. are pulled in. Don't worry, guys. We can come back from this. It's not a big deal. I think we'll be all right. Yeah, I'm trapped either way. So right. I'm, just, pausing just the... I'm pausing just this for a second. I'm pausing this for a second. There's too much going on. Too much going on. So we're going to yeah. hold it for just a second. Just use the time to to build up your fleets and do what you can. Don't worry. Just craziness. All this madness going on. There's a lot of madness going on. All right. They're in. Okay, so. Huh. So I just got my second ascension perk. I don't know oh. if you guys have looked at these recently. Yeah, we do. They have 30 transport fleets also. Just to let yeah. you know, so be ready for it. 30? 30. 30. Three zero. I've got a pretty large fleet building up. I'm going way over my 
naval capacity in an attempt to... So if you guys need minerals and energy, just let me know because now that my fleet is gone, I have <laughs> way, way much. Yeah, you're getting hit by a... But they want to vassalize you. We can't have them vassalize you. Yeah, don't worry. We, we won't just, agree just, to just that. Just survive, guys. We won't, yeah. we won't agree to it. Just yeah. avenge me. Avenge well, <laughs> uh, well, we just have to hit the Cormolan or whatever the heck they are. We just have to hit them fast and hard. Yep. You know, if we take them out, then that's going to make a difference. I need to know where the Keterians are. I think they're going to be wherever I am. I think they are going to follow my fleet, maybe. I'm set up for them to, I'm sure. I think I am. Yeah. Set to encourage allied fleets. So once I get stationed somewhere, as I think the Katarians will probably head towards me. I don't know where their fleet is right now. Um, but I'm looking for it. I was hoping it was going to be trailing behind me somewhere. Yeah, they they came prepared to this war, so there's pretty much nothing I can do to stop them. All right, I'm unpausing it, but I okay, dropped okay. it to normal speed though, because no that's fine. Yep. There's too much stuff going on at war, and we can miss things easily. Okay, I'm monitoring their fleets, just to let you guys know. Taking one of my planets now. Got a it doesn't ton of really, ships. It doesn't really matter what they take, as long as we fight back and get a high enough war score to get a decent settlement. Exactly. Yep. That's exactly. All right. Where's your fleet going? Because we we don't want you to get caught and get killed. Nope. I'm going to Vidua now, which is my home system. Vidua. All right. I see. I see. Okay. And I'm hoping they don't catch me on the way there, which I don't think they will. I've got a load of ships trailing behind me right now. Waiting to join up with me. A ton of ships I queued up to be built, and I'm going to keep queuing up more. Oh. Yeah, I'm just building Corvettes. I'm just going to way overbuild. If it drives my economy down, then whatever. It doesn't matter at this point. Yeah. Just just don't worry, Sabaz. If you need money or energy, just let me know because I have a, a way, way more than I'm using. S yeah, send me some minerals then if you wouldn't mind, Vanguard. Please. So I can build more vets. Okay, my fleet is en route. Yeah, they're heading towards me still. That's gonna be a invaluable. Okay, my fleet's finally Thank slowing ahead, down. Man. Thank you, sir. Welcome. Which is good because I've got a lot of ships now that are catching up with me. Complete. Yeah, all those yeah my defense army doesn't have a chance against 30 fleet. 30, 30 size fleet. Oh boy, Just they're heading sure towards my capital system. Are you heading this way? It's My ships are already en route. Okay, perfect. They to vid... Do yeah, you? to Vidu. Unless you want to, unless you want to fall back somewhere else, I would. I would jump the hell out of there if I was you. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah, they're coming for me. All right, jump. Let's meet in. Um, let's Isus. meet in Jugguard or Karagos. Okay, I can do that. All right. Hopefully they don't catch me. All right, jump into Karagos. Construction complete. It was unfortunate run, run, run. that we were at the other end of the galaxy. I know it really threw me off. Just monitoring you guys now. Yeah, I hate to be abandoning my my planet, my home planet, like this. But they're gonna have to have a pretty strong troop force too to take it down. Yeah, just build as many defense forces and assault forces as you can, Sabots, on your home oh, planet. I, you're going to I, need it. I have. I loaded the planet right up. Yeah, you're going to need Wait. about 50 to stop the ground attack. Just to hey, let you know. Oh, I, I put as many as I could on there. Um, oh. So Jug, Jugdar or whatever, that's where you're heading and you're almost there. Yeah, I see you coming. So their fleets... Oh, the Katarians are coming. Katarians are coming to meet up with my fleet. Okay. Awesome. Okay. 
Okay, I'm jumping to uh, Kurgaros. Yeah, that's where I'm. That's where I'm going to, and I've got all my like individual vets. They're all gonna. They're all gonna meet us there. Okay, if the Kitarians go for it. Okay, the Kitarians are going for their fleet, so I'm gonna follow them in. Okay. Um, because the Kitarians won't be able to kill them by themselves, but they will be able to kill them with me. Okay, go. They, I'll jump. I'll jump Mo, as soon as I can. Just another advice: avoid using missiles. They have pretty much. Unpenetrable point of defense weapon, so just let you know. Well, too late to remodel oh, that hold part on. now. What the heck are the Katarians <laughs> doing? Are they not going? Well, so actually, long? most of the most of the ships that I have are vets with disruptors on them, so it's fine. Okay. Okay. So never mind. The Katarians decided to do something else. They're not going for their fleet. They flew past their fleet, and they're going for their. I don't know where they're going. Meet me in. You're in still going to Kurgaros, right? You want me somewhere else? No, just meet me in Kurgaros. I'll meet you there. Okay. I see your fleet coming in. I'm super overbuilt right now. So am I. I'm like 47 negative energy now. And that was after doing all those upgrades that I did. Yeah, I'm way overbuilt. Okay, our fleets are together. Let's move down into Isis now, or Isus. Okay, hold on one second. Hold on one second. All right, where do you want to jump? Uh, Isus, right below us. Okay, jumping now. Hey, Mo, I sent you some energy so you don't have any issues. Oh, thanks, buddy. We'd be screwed already if you hadn't been sending that stuff to us. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's all I can do. They can't take my home planet, so they're just bombarding it right now. They're open to us assaulting. Once we take this fleet and push it back, I can take my planets back. You ready to jump into the next system? If we wait I a second, I'll have more ships here. Okay, yep, let's wait. I mean, I've got I a, sent you 1,000. I got a ton coming in. Do you see yeah. mine coming in? <laughs> yeah, I've got like 15 or 20 ships headed in. I'm like, I'm like 80 overbuilt right now. Oh, God, you're a lifesaver. Bruno, mm -hmm. thank you so much for that. <laughs> no problem. I'm just going to keep sending you guys resources so you can hey, avenge it'll, me. It'll, well, it'll get you out of being vassalized. That's the most important thing. Yeah, I don't exactly. think that, that I don't think his fleets are just sitting on you. They're not coming down here to help. No, they're no. not. They're just trying to conquer my planets. I'm not making this easy for them. Yeah, exactly. As long as you just keep them stalled, the Katarians are already waging war against the Comerlian in their home system. Yeah. Actually, the I'm Katarians... just trying to keep track on the, of their fleets. I'll let you know. The One Katarians of them just actually, moving yeah. towards you, so you know. The 12k fleet is moving towards you. Is it? Okay, we should hit them now. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Hold on. You have hold like on, hold on, five hold on. minutes or so. We are. What you're going we to are do. We're already over on time. So I know that we're like all like super into this, but we should. Oh yeah. We should. We should wait. We should wait. And uh, uh, in between episodes, we can kind of look and we can strategize a little bit. And when we start up with the next one, we can tell people what our plan is and kind of take it from there. All okay. right. Right. Is that you guys agree? Yeah. Sure. I'm good sure. with that. Okay. That's a good cliffhanger. <laughs> <laughs> well, no. yeah, but see what'll happen is people will be like, cliffhanger, dislike, dislike, dislike. <laughs> There's always that guy, man. There always is. It doesn't, you know. <laughs> oh, man. All right, folks. Well, hope that you enjoyed this one. And if you did, please consider hitting that thumbs up. Thanks so much for watching. Till next time, I'm Mal, joined by fellow scumbags, Sabouts, and Vanguard. And we will see you later. <laughs>